The K-Rain K1 rotary sprinkler is designed for watering areas between 15 to 30 feet and can be adjusted wet or dry. In this video, you will learn how to set and adjust the K1 sprinkler. This sprinkler is adjusted from a left start position, meaning it starts from the left and rotates clockwise and then returns. Let's first look at the indicators on the sprinkler head. Keyhole, nozzle arrow, spray pattern arrow, spray pattern slot, distance screw. And now the parts of the riser. Turret, riser, left start slot, distance screw. There are three easy steps to set the sprinkler. Find left start, set left start, set right stop. Insert the K key partway into the keyhole, turn it slightly and pull up. Hold the bottom half of the riser in one hand and remove the key. Turn the nozzle turret to the right until you hear a click. Then, turn the turret back to the left until you hear another click. Notice the position of the nozzle arrow. It should align with the left start slot on the side of the riser. Turn only the lower half of the riser to the left until the nozzle arrow points to your desired left start position. Then, carefully and slowly release the riser. Insert the key into the spray pattern slot indicated by the plus and minus arrows. While holding the top of the nozzle turret with your fingers, turn the slot until the gray spray pattern arrow in the center points to your desired right stop position. In this example, the right stop is set at the 180 degree position. This sprinkler is set to rotate 180 degrees from your left start position and then return. To increase or decrease the spray distance, insert the key into the silver distance screw located in the white nozzle arrow. The distance screw allows you to adjust the distance to your preference. That's it! You've now learned how to set and adjust the K1 rotary sprinkler.